it's uh, uh, Simone de Beauvoir said, you know, when you get to be a, an old lady, if you don't have something interesting, you'll be left all alone. Oh. <laughs> social thing as well as playing for people. Oh, nice. I've also encountered a lot of brats that I would like to clobber. Uh, I had a nasty idea of putting a thumbtack point up on the top of the cat's head so when they <laughs> hit it with their balloons, it'll pop the balloons. <laughs> <laughs> That'll fix you. <laughs> Now I want the uh, money box. And next, the amplifier. That is a, a nice package. Now I'm going to want the white blue box. I want to show off my new shirt that I got too many clothes on. It isn't exactly my color, <laughs> but I'm not worried about things like that. My clothes go from being worn to becoming rags. And if, it, if it's something that's too beautiful, I don't wear it that much. How did you come to build the little cat? I thought, well, you know, someone had said to me, uh, you know, maybe you should dress up, maybe put a bow ribbon in your hair or something. <laughs> People want something that's fun to look at. <clears throat> I have never been fun to look at. <laughs> and so I thought I would make something that people would like to look at. She needs more thing. And it's pretty. The children like it. And better that they look at the cat and enjoy it. And, and you know, if I just went out and played the guitar, and that was all, everybody's doing that. And, um, you know, that that doesn't go. so that 
I don't have to use my hands. There's an ancient toy where you sit on a paddle and there's a figure on the end of a stick and you tap the paddle and it makes a figure dance. You don't have your hands free. And then you step on it. That's a striptease outfit. <laughs> She's got her little stars there, and does the cat have a name? Effigy. Effigy. Effigy? Yeah, like burnt in effigy. Oh. If I have another one, I'll name her Conniption. But it's not easy to tell people what the name is, because they, they don't hear that word a lot. They'll say, Effigene? No, I ain't effigy. She can do crunches like James Fonda. <laughs> oh yeah. Well, Jane Fonda can't do it this way. <laughs> I had to uh, really take a good look at cats' noses, how that work, how the shape was. There, uh, that's fringe that you can buy at a fabric store, and I had a hard time finding lavender fringe. And I put the sequins on it, and I went to tap plastic and got her navel, that broom there, you know, the black broom. That's where her whiskers came from. Hello, thank you. First one. Mm-hmm. <laughs>